What is going on guys? Welcome to version 3 of the Corsair K65 series gaming lighting profiles. What I'm going to do is go ahead and shut off my lamp. And then from there, we're going to do all the default uh default or the all the profiles that I have accrued since the last making of my video, which was version 2. So some of these profiles you may have seen already, some profiles are going to be completely new to you. Alright, so let me go ahead and turn down the DPI on my mouse since I'm not gaming. So, we're going to go up, okay, again I believe if you've already seen my uh, previous video, you've already seen this one. So I'm going to let it scroll down a couple of times, looks pretty cool. So this is one up. Next is going to be 39. So that's what it looks like when you hit something. It uh, On here it lights up. So this is 39. Next is going to be American flag. Again, nothing's going to happen when you hit a button here. So. Next up is going to be Bacon Donut. Believe it or not, this is the lighting profile. Don't know why it's called a Bacon Donut, but hey, I downloaded and installed it because I thought it was cool. So, um, some of these you can hit pa uh, pause slash break, and it might do something a little different. Okay. Next up is going to be Bat Blue Wings. Okay. Next up is going to be bat orange wings for obvious reasons. Next is just going to be beating heart. Again, I believe the heart is purple or pink or turns in one of those colors. I would have this red. Again, I still need to see if I can edit this profile to make it red. All right, next up is going to be big camera, I believe. And I'm not sure if you hit a button. Yeah, it lights up, so... Okay, next up, we're going to do Block Breaker. I think that's pretty cool if you ask me. I'm not sure if you hit uh, the pause break button if it'll do anything differently. Nope. Let's see if I hit the space bar if that does anything. Nope. So it just looks pretty cool. Okay, next up is going to be a Blue Knight Rider theme. Next is going to be checker. Again, it's not really going to do anything at all when you hit the space bar or anything. Next is going to be Christmas for obvious reasons. So, has a little EMP effect on there. Next is going to be complexity gaming, I believe. So that doesn't do anything if you hit any buttons. Okay, next up is going to be Corrosive. Okay, next up, this is going to be an interesting one. This is called Corsair Gaming. And uh, you have a lot of different profiles on here. Some are meant for uh, FPGs, MMOs, and a couple other profiles. So I'm going to go ahead and what you do is, if I'm, yeah, I'm in the shot, if you hit pause slash break, different keys light up for certain profiles that you would need or want when you're gaming. So I believe this is MMO, don't quote me, and then keep on going. And there's more, and then there's a regular one. So I think that's pretty cool, so I'm going to go ahead and do that again. Okay, there's another one. Last profile and the beginning. I think that's pretty freaking cool if you ask me. So, there you go. That's why you would want to create a profile to someone who says, I don't see the point in these keyboards having a lighting on it. Okay, this is the Doppler. EMP. Does that. Next is going to be the equalizer. 
nothing happens on that profile. This is a new one called Frogger. So it pretty much has this green, wherever it is, <laughs> light up and then it's pretty cool. So. Okay, next is going to be Full Force. I believe this is something new, I'm not sure. Um, if you guys have seen it or not. Okay, we're going to scroll down. We have a lot to uh, see. Next is, is going to be Ghost. And it pretty much lights up very faintly where you're typing, which is pretty cool. Okay, next, this is going to be Guild Wars. And if you see my video, my previous video, you'll see how I converted it from the K70 profile to work on my K65 um, keyboard. And I have a video about that, and you can go ahead and check that out. It's about six minutes long. And then I found an error in my ways of what I was doing wrong right in within the video. As soon as I found out, I just kept it in to show people on what I did. Okay, next is going to be Halloween Pumpkin. We're going to go ahead and do Heartbeat. So I don't believe, yeah, I think it changes color or does it? Let me see. Well, I think it changes color briefly, then goes back to the standard color. Okay, next is going to be Heat Vision. And Heat Vision is pretty much when you type it, it has a like a warm red kind of deal. Okay, next is going to be Hitman Absolution. And this is has an EMP effect, but I think it would be cool if they could implement it into the game to tie into the keyboard is like if you get hit, like your whole keyboard would light up red or your mouse would light up red or something. I think that would be cool if they can somehow figure out how to implement it in games. This is going to be the Knight Rider. It's not going to be like the blue one where it's back and forth. It's just a continuous flow of red. So I would like to see it go back and forth. Next is going to be Lava Pool. Next is going to be Lightning Shockwave. And I think if you, yeah, if you hit a button, it's going to like scatter like a lightning strike. So it's pretty cool. Okay, next up. Let me go ahead and go down. Okay, this was the lightning strike, I believe. This is lightning strike. And the other one was a uh, uh, lightning shockwave. So there we go. Next up is living rainbow. So go ahead and hit that again, show you guys what it looks like. Next favorite movie is going to be the matrix nothing happens really just it's more for show next is going to be minecraft this is new um i'm not sure if it does anything if you hit anything but this is something new nine keys that's pretty much self-explanatory there pac-man payday two and i believe these turn uh yellow if you hit them so yeah okay next up plasma and this has an EMP effect as well next up this is gonna be rainbow and it doesn't really do anything and then uh, next up is gonna be rainbow all around so there you go hit the space bar does that Next is going to be Rainbow Colliders. So it doesn't do anything when I hit the space bar on that. Next is going to be Rainbow Fireworks. And so if you hit that, it kind of changes color real quick. Okay, next up we're going to do Rainbow Link. There's a lot of rainbow fro uh, profiles I've noticed. So if you hit certain buttons on here, they're going to light up certain profile or certain area of the keyboard. Next is going to be Rainbow Random, Rainbow Relapse, Rainbow Retraction, 
so it doesn't do anything when I hit the space bar there so let me go ahead and scroll down to the other profiles that's rainbow retraction I'm not sure if I said that or not this is rainbow straight next up is going to be rainbow hole so that changes the whole keyboard this is going to be rave the annoying one like I like to say next is going to be reactive rainbow so do that that okay next is going to be Sinon Spectrum, I think that's how you pronounce it. But it has like a little wavelength. It doesn't do anything other than change color. Okay, next is Sonar. Now this this is pretty cool, and I'm going to try to get my mouse in the profile as well. So, as you guys know, if you didn't know, I was in the Navy, and I used to be a Sonar tech, so this is pretty cool. So if I hold the mouse over here, you can kind of see it lighting up as well. So this is kind of like, it's spinning around, and then you have this one that's beating with it too, which I think is pretty darn cool. So next, um, we're going to go ahead and go to Space Invader, and there's two profiles in here, and I found that out. So if you don't like this one, you can hit the pause one, and it has this one changing. So if you just want the little green dude in the middle, just do that. So hit pause break. And then after that, go ahead and change it so you'll see the whole guy coming over. Alright, next up we're going to have Starman right there. I'm not sure if you hit pause break. So, some of this stuff I'm just realizing, like they keyed the pause break profile. So, if you hit pause break, it's going to change the color like you're seeing now. Okay. Next up is streak. And I'm hitting pause break right now, as you can see. So, it does change as I'm doing that so this is something that I'm showing you guys I'm not sure if you guys even knew about it because I sure didn't know so I'm gonna hit pause break again to see if that changes that looks like 1G on it and then a couple more then back to 1G okay we have Super Saiyan you hit pause, break, it actually has a uh, little sound effect to go with it and everything like that. But guys, that is the conclusion of the video, I believe. Let me see if there's any more. We got a couple of more. Sorry about that. So this is going to be the river. And let me see if I hit pause, break, if it'll change anything. So there. Okay. Next is going to be thunderstorm. So let me see. Pause. Break. Doesn't do anything when I hit that. Triple color pulse. So let me see if I hit that. Okay. I'm not sure if it does anything, but that looks pretty cool. Okay. Next up, it's underwater. So it doesn't do anything when I hit pause break. And then the last one is wavelength. And then I hit pause break, it doesn't do anything. Alright guys, that is the conclusion of the video. And I accidentally did that by accident cameras not working with me today but anyways guys thank you for watching appreciate watching this video sorry if it's kinda long it is 132 a.m. here this Monday morning so I hope everybody's having a great morning and as always comment subscribe rate this video click that like button and you guys always have a great day now